By the way, if you're wondering what this thing is, that's my dog, so don't mind her. Hey guys, it's Lisa. So in today's video, I'm going to be doing a try on Romwe haul. I actually have never ordered anything off of Romwe before, so I'm really excited to like share with you guys this stuff. I'm not going to lie, this stuff is very summer based because when I was shopping, I was just in a very summery mood and I'm going on vacation soon. So that's what most of this stuff is geared towards, but I'm so excited for summer that I'm done winter shopping, no more sweaters. Don't forget to give the video a thumbs up and if you're new to my channel, welcome and don't forget to hit that subscribe button. It'd be really nice and I'd appreciate it a lot. So without further ado, let's just get into the haul. I have everything in the bag right here. I did open it because I'm super impatient and couldn't wait to do like an unboxing because I don't know. If something comes in the mail, I'm just gonna open it. I can't, I can't wait. I'm pretty sure Romwe and Shein are the same company because I have ordered stuff off of Shein, but like this was a specifically Romwe order and some of the bags say Shein on them, which doesn't really make sense to me because if they're the same, if they're being manufactured at the same like uh, place, why can't they just make it one company? Which doesn't really make sense, but you know, they do them. I feel like this video will be good to do because I feel like a lot of hauls about Romwe, I'm gonna be blatantly honest with you guys. Like if I don't like something, I'm gonna tell you because I feel like a lot of Romwe hauls are sponsored by Romwe so people feel obligated to say nice things about them, you know, so they keep sending them goodies. But I'm just gonna be 100% honest because they didn't send me this stuff and I ordered this all on my own. So, yep, let's just begin. So the first thing that I got from Romwe was this cropped, uh, like, t-shirt. It's kind of like the shirt I'm wearing right now. You can't really see it, but it's just a cropped, um, like, shirt. This quality is, like, okay, I would say. It's not, like, great quality, but it's, it's definitely, like, Forever 21 quality. And the only thing, though, with this, first of all, it is super cute, though. Like, I love the yellow stripes on this because yellow, like, this mustardy yellow color is absolutely my favorite color right now. So I really like that about it, and it's just a very, like, chill and nice shirt. But the only thing that is bothering me about this shirt is that the sleeves are, like, too short. Like, they're not um, three-quarter length sleeves, but... Is that even what they're called? But they're not like full length sleeves. So for me to wear this, I have, maybe I just have really long arms. I don't know. But for me to wear this, I do have to kind of scrunch it up to like my elbow just so it doesn't look like it's too small or it's shrunk in the dryer, if that makes sense. But other than that, I really do like this. I feel like this would be super cute to wear like on a chill day or, you know, with some jeans or even jean shorts and some van slip-ons, you know, a look. The second thing I got, I can tell you, I am obsessed with these. So I'm pretty sure this print is called Gangnam. Ga Gangnam? I don't even know what it's called, but they're just, I'm just gonna call it picnic table. Um, I got these picnic table pattern pants, which are super cute, and I am so excited to wear these. Like, I'm gonna wear these everywhere. I just think they're super cute. These pants I got in a medium, which fit like a small, because I do normally wear a small. So they, I would just recommend sizing up if you're gonna get these pants, but they're so cute, and they have a bow that ties in the front, which is beautiful, and I love it so much. And yes, I really enjoy these pants and I'm definitely gonna be wearing those a lot. And then, since you know I'm gonna do the same picnic table print, I might as well show you the next thing I got. So it's this dress. I think this is so cute. It's the same exact uh, fabric as the pants, so not the best, but you know, for the price, I'm not complaining because everything is so cheap off of Romwe. So I really can't complain and I'm not. Like, I, I'm gonna wear all this stuff. So I do really like this as well and I just think this is one of those dresses that you see all over Instagram and if you go to find this, like this is on Brandy Melville, this would be like $34 but I think from Romwe it was only like $10.99 or something like that, like what a steal. Uh, the next thing I got was this plain white cropped um, long sleeve t-shirt which is going to be so good just to wear with anything because I need more basic shirts like this. So yeah, this is just like average uh, quality, like it's pretty decent and it was pretty cheap. So I like this too, probably gonna wear this a lot. And I liked how it's just like straight across cut. So it has like that more like 
raw edge to it instead of like being sewn under which is really nice so this next item I'm most likely gonna be selling on my Poshmark or I'm gonna return it or make a depop and sell it because uh, this unfortunately it fits but it is so short on me so I'm personally not gonna be able to wear this and it's just like insanely short like I kid you not I've gotten away with wearing like short skirts before but this is like really short so yeah, the lighting why does the lighting have to go bad like that I do not I am Confucia I do not understand so like I was saying this skirt is so cute though because I had such a cute outfit planned with this when I went on vacation but I'm gonna have to find another skirt or just return it but I really don't feel like returning it because since it's coming from like a different country that's such a hassle to return things so yeah it is super good quality though so it's a it, this is like really good quality for the price so if you are pretty short I would definitely recommend this but if you're I'm not tall at all but like if you're like semi tall or like average height that's gonna be too short <laughs> the next two shirts I got are the same exact style just different colors so they're just these off the shoulder please tell me this looks like it would fit an American Girl doll this is so small but it actually does fit because it's really stretchy but it looks so tiny and when I pulled it out of the packaging I was like there's no way this is gonna fit me but it actually did, which I was surprised, but I think this one is so cute. You can wear these with so many different things. And then I also got it in black, and this was, these are in size small. Oh, I forgot to say, I keep forgetting to say the size of stuff. If I forget, I'll put it on the screen somewhere, but I got the same one in black. The black one is actually more stretchier than the white one, which is a little strange, but I really do like these, and we'll definitely be wearing these with, like, so many different outfits. And I do like how they're lettuce cut, which I love that word, lettuce cut. Like, whoever came up with that term, like, I love them. That's, I love, love like, relating food items to clothing, great. This next top I got is just a white bandeau top. This was actually not what I was expecting because this is so sheer. Like, it, I, I was expecting to be able to wear this with, like, out a bra, but I, you really can't because it's so sheer. But they have, like, other um, prints of this, and I saw, like, people's reviews, and they were, like, thicker material. So I think it's just this white one. The concept is so cute, though, and I'm probably going to keep it because I can just wear something, like, like a nude bandeau underneath it. But that kind of, like, defeats the whole purpose. But it is super cute, and I love how it's, like, lettuce cut and... I really like it. The last apparel thing that I got was this bathing suit, which is super cute. I don't own any one pieces, so I thought this would be cute just to like take pictures in. That's honestly why I bought it, but it was inexpensive, so it's not really like that big of a deal, but it's just white and like has a lace up right here. The only thing with this bathing suit, it is very good quality. I will say that like this is surprisingly like such good quality for the price. But I wish that it was a little bit more high cut. It's kind of just like a basic um, one piece and I kind of want it to be more high cut and like a little more revealing, you know? But it's, but like I'm not complaining because I'm still gonna wear it and I think it's really cute. I forgot one thing, so let me go get that. I got two accessories off of Ramwe. So the first accessory that I'm so excited about is this hat which is so cute this reminds me of like the hamptons and like gossip girl for some reason but i'm so excited to wear this on vacation i'm obsessed with it i just think it's so cute like do you want to hear my uh picture envision this is what i was envisioning when i was buying this i was envisioning wearing this bathing suit and like this hat by the pool like i like plan out a whole scene in my head and then like i go and find the items which is a little strange but you know I think this hat is so cute and I love that a lot. The last thing that I got from Romwe was this necklace right here. It might be hard to see, but it's just a gold um, choker that has stars and little diamonds on it, which is so pretty. And I need to start buying more like dangly jewelry because, or like dainty jewelry because I don't own like that many but it's just so cute and i think it would look cute with like any outfit any of these outfits i bought it would look so pretty with so that is everything i got from romwe i would suggest like if you're looking for um like clothes to get for like you know the upcoming summertime and stuff definitely like check out romwe um the quality is kind of like it is really good it's kind of like forever 21 quality but there is some stuff that's like a little like lesser quality than others so i just recommend reading the reviews i always do that and if something's like really bad quality and a lot of people don't like it then obviously don't buy it 
But yeah, that is pretty much it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed watching, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!